Christine, thank you very much for joining us in this executive training on equality and, and uh, you know, policies and law against discrimination. Um, I would like to ask you how was the experience of teaching basic principles and even procedures of uh, you know, legal cases uh, of discrimination to people who don't have a legal background and actually some had some experience but most didn't. Well, it's quite a challenge. I think it's important that you really look at the audience to see whether they grasp the concepts and if you see that they don't, you try to explain it in a different way. Um, and I must say they were quite vocal, like when they didn't get it, they just asked questions. And I must say sometimes it was challenging to understand the question because especially when it was coming from people with a social science background, they didn't grasp the concept. So it was sometimes really, you know, touch and go to see to find whether you could meet each other around the way but um, no, in the end I think it went well and especially while they were reading the cases I invited them to read some cases of the European Court of Human Rights I had to explain a bit like how to go about it but once they got at it you could see really in the groups they were engaging with them with, with the discussion with the argumentation and I think they also enjoyed me asking them to be critical like it's not because the European Court of Human Rights says it that it's particularly always right or the right way of approaching it and I quite like the way social scientists and also people from different disciplinary backgrounds brought their take on it because uh, it's also refreshing for me to take that into account I'm like okay that's another way of looking at it and things that I could also possibly use in my argumentation, mm. legal argumentation. Uh, yeah, I mean the, it's an interesting exchange. I had this feeling as well that sometimes people were not replying or not asking what they were expected to ask. Mm. But I, I thought um, it was also your role of humanizing the judge and say, you know, the judge has certain principles, certain laws and has a case and what do they need or when you invited them to look at, uh, you know, what kind of evidence the judge can use. Um, yeah, that, that was really refreshing. Yeah, and I think especially the cases on the Roma, I gave them two cases towards the end on, on Roma, systemic discrimination, that they could see, like they know of course a bit of the background of the Roma, and they could see how it's kind of somehow reduced before the court and how it's kind of fighting to get the full complexity of the case before, you know, to be really considered by the judges. It's like, yeah, it's a challenge. And to see that, in the, to, to see, for them to see that reflected in the way the reasoning goes in the judgment, I think that was also quite interesting, yeah. Yes, indeed. Thank you very much. We look Thank forward you. to having you again in our well, training. Well, please do, <laughs> by all means. <laughs>